wearing in this picture, okay, the hat, the shirt, those are team-issued things, right? Only the coaches of Central Michigan will have that. There are many ways that he could have had access to getting that. And once you have that, it's honestly not that hard to sneak onto the field. Not many coaches, definitely not any players. When I was there as a player, I never would have thought twice about a guy I hadn't really seen before. If he has team-issued gear on and he looks like a coach, which he does, no one's going to ask questions. So yes, option one is that McElwain had no knowledge of what was happening, that this guy snuck onto the field um, and he just acted on his own and had Central had nothing to do with it. Option two, which is more unlikely, would be that he did know about it and that he did have something to do with it. The fact that McElwain is sitting up here in the press conference and can't identify him, right? It, he could easily just say, oh no, that's so-and-so, that's a coach on our staff, all these rumors are false. He did not do that. He went on, this, on the stand and said, we're going to look into it, which means he has no idea who the guy is. Easily could be Connor Stallings. That's the only 